What's up, everybody? How's everybody doing? All right. So today's gonna be another live episode. You can see the webcam. That typically means that I'm doing a live thing here. So let's, let's do this. So we've kind of laid down some basic materials here for this pistol. My your ref. I give a little more better ideas here of what we want to do. So we want to make sure that these like it's easy for us to be able to tell the different types of metals right now, like the different I guess metal breakup, right? Um this rubber is trying to bug me. Kill that rubber now. Rubber base. Sharp. I don't know what that sharpens I can do in. Gives it a little bit more detail. Keep that, but. Yeah. So, we're going to continue with the breakup here. We need, so we have. Still dark. Need to kind of add a little bit more here. Go to the selection tool. Start adding. And now we have like this steel dark here. Completely accurate. So let's just paint and let's press X to. Uh, to invert the selection we're gonna go to polys we're just gonna undo it and then we're gonna go back to steel dark here we're going to invert it again to make sure it's white so we can actually select it we're going to this want it to be dark Dark. We also want this to be dark as well. That. What else do we want dark? We also want this is a bit darker. Some faces here. So this is polygon fill. So, triangle convert. we get well, there we go so that's dark again I'm pretty sure it's just for material breakup we'll add in a lot more details from on for now now um what I'm also noticing is that this have, we have a few different rays, right? We have this other steel. So I think what we can do here is we or even more material breakup and do is we can And I want to go make that different color. Um, 
something like that. Pick the dark steel here and let's just again for a little bit of breakup. For this we want the glass material, so add in another here. Paint. Glass. Material here. So, what do we need? We don't need height. Take on roughness. Take off normal. Base color will make it white. Roughness. So very smooth, metallic, a black mass, paint layer, and then we're just going to go to selection, we'll go to triangles, paint this in now. Polygon fill. Triangle fill. Oh, I see. That's why it's doing the triangles. We have that. And then for that, we need like a little red, little red dot material. So again, I'm getting into a little bit of the nitty gritty here, which I shouldn't. Be focusing more on like the bigger stuff but since i'm here might as well just do it color height roughness normal we'll need the normal um we'll need metal roughness will be very rough but we'll do the little paint here And what we'll do, we'll probably need brush. Brush, we need hard. Something like that. I'm just going to save this here. And then for glass, maybe I'll just and go paint. Sorry if my my voice is pretty monotone. Um, I'm doing a lot of these recordings usually super late at night with my daughter and my son. My wife are passed out and asleep. And obviously, you know, I would love your guys' feedback. This is really, really boring for you all. And that I probably should just do time lapse videos in, in the near future when uh, things have gone a little bit better. And maybe perhaps I'll go back to these live videos. Um, so let me quickly check this out. So this steel dark. Seems like here I'm gonna X to clear and we'll clear this little attachment rail clip. We're just gonna add the dark here. Here there. And then for this one, I 
painted one here. Um, it's going to unselect this here. Take steel dark. Always fill, fill that up. And I'm just going to go into um, channels mode here. Right now, this is color mode. Color right now. It's base color right now. Uh, that's quite. Quite bright, a little bit, a little more grayish color. That helps us see which areas. Yeah, so having this as a different color would be nice as well for again color breakup um so let's quickly do that in one second Okay, so let's see. Um, so we need the dark. So let's go with real dark. So that's the steel dark. So the steel dark right there, which is looking a little bit closer. Okay, no, that's not it. Steel dark eight. This one. So this one um, is now starting to look metal. Station. Hmm. Okay. So I'm going to have to bring this back up a little bit. This steel dark age. Huh. Okay. Okay. So you can see clearly the three different colors of metal. We got this one, this one, and this one, right? So we're gonna put this one. A little bit of yellow there. What's going on there? Oh. Just like reflecting, maybe. Okay. Sorry, I got sidetracked. Um. So we're gonna put. This one over there. Let's go steel. Here. We'll go polyfill. That there. And then um, I'm looking at the concept here. There's an even dark 
Okay, and we're looking for a little bell. I didn't realize that my mesh got triangulated this whole process like everything's triangulated and everything that's normal never had that before I don't know if it's new very interesting it's only triangulated here it might be because it detected something weird. It wasn't full all quads or something. Or it had an end gone. So now it's doing that, essentially. Okay, so there we go. So now we have kind of like our basic, all of our basic materials are now in. Let's check out this flashlight. Now we kind of need some more color there, so we'll definitely do some more color there. Uh, hold on, no, we we'll need field work. Go to cells. Uh, there. Good, I think. Let's go there. There we go. Yep. Now we're good. Please save that. Now we have our whole. Okay, um, so now let's get into some of the nitty gritty um, texturing stuff. Actually, hold on, we still need to kind of, yeah, let's get into the nitty gritty texturing stuff. So, for this back part, we're gonna need some new materials here. Um, we're gonna go. We're gonna add fill material. We can call this here. It's gonna be like I don't know, gas indicator, or let's go like display or LCD or something. Uh, let's go with green. We're gonna make a new folder for this. Or like or something. This is the green. Uh, go to add black mask. Black mask. This we're gonna paint. And for here we're actually gonna paint here. Paint. this the paint inside here because that's where the LCD is going to be so this is like the, the base part of it uh, so we're just going to go for now we'll just do color no height no normal map. I think it's just gonna be color for now. Color. Pick uh, from the concept art. 
Oh, we're going to add Sugi, we're going to call this like red or something. And then from here, we're going to go with some alphas. It's uh. Hopefully there's some square alphas here. Sharp lines. That that would be really handy. Uh, the lines are but no that's not gonna work we just need so this here which is good so where this guy um Right here, perfect. That there, make this a little smaller, oh, and I can just go erase. And hmm. see, let's see what I want to do here. Do I want to do it that way, or I can go add a layer? This let's see. all right, and then. Do is I pick the color. I'm just gonna pick the color. So red. Then. So orange. If I need to, I can just watch it a little bit more. I'll leave it that for now. Can continue to add here, and then we'll make it a missive as well. So it looks cooler. But for now, we're just kind of getting keep doing this until we. Up all colors. Can do is we can just accelerate this a little bit more.
Actually, I kind of got that going. Um, and then we could, so this could use an emissive. This. Oh yeah, so we kind of get the idea here. Obviously, this is not looking the greatest. I'm gonna have to go in and redo a lot of this stuff, but probably gonna have to go in and. Let's see here. So let's go. So we can move everything up, right? Definitely move everything up. I think we go and do that. Let's quickly just get. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We can make this even simpler. Let's make this even more simple. Okay. Colors. Emissive. Get this into perspective for you here. Your poor turn off perspective. This is probably going to be my last thing that I do before. Or log off here. So something like this. So like that. In that. Uh, I'll just go something as simple as that. Here. Here, just like this. So, thing this, that, that, that. Right, and what we're gonna do is take this and kind of put it like that. And then we're simplifying it. So this is a little bit more different than the um, than the concept. That's okay. So let's go with like an orange. We'll go into like a red. Active, yeah, the emissive going on as well. And this is just a little bit more of a simplified version of having to do like all those lines, which I think just kind of serves that purpose. Um, cool. And then we're gonna have to do some more details and stuff like that all around. But overall, this is looking pretty decent. We got good kind of, kind of base, everything's kind of down. Is important. Uh, so let's quickly save this. Oh. Let's quickly save that. And uh, we'll continue this next time. All right. Take it easy. Stay awesome.